Hey, this is going to be the assembly video of the Gearstar, which is this model. I already printed everything out. As you can see, I used the brim for the gears and the connectors. And the heart didn't need any adhesion. So yeah, first step print everything out. And if you're lucky, the drill disconnects that easy. Okay, so we have our heart right here. And as you can see, it's numbered. The big gears are going to be placed on every side that has a number one. Those sides are also square shaped. So yeah, just put in a connector inside of a gear like this and then push it in to the heart with the other side and that's how we are going to connect this. There's also something important as you can see right here we have two different small gears they are slightly different wait one second so yeah this one has a gap on the edge and this one has a tooth of the gear on the edge so we will be sorting these by type So that we don't confuse them. And now the triangle shaped sides have the number two and sometime, uh, some sides have the number three. And what we will need to be doing is that we are going to choose one of these small gears. It doesn't really matter which type. And we are going to put only this type right here onto the sides with the number three and then only this type right here onto the sides with the number two. So let me show you that. Again we will be putting in the connectors and then the side with all little cap on the edge will be number two. Just like this. Okay, so it may look like this when you are connecting it. Um, you will need to spin this big gear until you uh, until this edge aligns perfectly. So it should look like this. The, this teeth catches into the gap of this piece. And now what we are going to do is we are going to connect another piece, this time num uh, one number three piece and we are going to push it in right here and this should then align perfectly with this side so yeah it's just the same thing all over again so yeah that's what we are going to do for the whole thing
So just like this. And now we are going to sort everything so that the edges are completely aligned. As you can see this one is still a little bit off. Now it's perfect. Same thing here. Just like this, then push everything in a little tighter. Okay, so here's a common mistake you might end up with at the end. As you can see, this piece right here doesn't align with the edges. And even if I turn it a little bit, there's no way I can align it. That means that this piece is, uh, was put in on the wrong side. If you have one piece like this, there should be another piece somewhere that has the same issue, which is also of a different type. So as you can see, there's a gap right here, and um, this piece has a tooth on the edge, and there's a gap. Uh, this one has a gap on the edge. So yeah, what you can do to fix this is just take both of them out, uh, out, and then. Let them switch positions and this fixes this problem.